A recent failed A event from a good friend and client prompted me to write this. Some of them might seem like common sense, but it's easy to make the mistake of doing something stupid the day before your big event. So here's my top 10 things not to do the day before your target event. Number one, doing nothing. This will surprise some people, but actually I don't know anyone who performs better the day after complete rest. Some form of day before routine is essential, just don't leave it until the day before your target event to develop. Use smaller events and testing to do this. Once you've settled on what works, do not change it the day before your target races. Number two, eat junk. Fairly common sense, but it is easy to mess up, especially if you're traveling to an event or with your mates. Eat a decent meal and don't go over the top and try to limit the amount of fats which will be harder for you to digest. Number three, fail to hydrate. In the same way that carb loading might be useful for someone racing longer than a couple of hours, hydrating more could have a similar effect. This is particularly important if it's going to be a hot day. Number four, stay up late. Again, sleep is something that you could load up on if you think you'll be getting less the day before your big event. But don't make it hard on your body by staying up late. Number five, adjust your bike. Do not, under any circumstance, change anything on your bike the day before, unless you absolutely have to. Have your bike ready at least a week in advance. Number six, adjust your kit. The same goes for your kit. The day before your big event is not the time to change your cleats, footwear, headwear, try new shorts or anything like that. Stick to what you know works. Number seven, forget your bag. Pack a bag with all your bits in it and then don't forget it. I have a list of items that you might need to take to an event on my website, which you can use. Number eight, anything stressful. Do not allow yourself to get stressed. Probably harder than it seems, especially if you're traveling or with your mates and so on. Stress will contribute towards mental fatigue and a poor ride. Number nine, drink or take drugs. Sounds obvious, but avoid anything like drink or drugs. Drugs includes remedies like sleeping pills, which will remain in your system race day. Number 10, change your plan. If you've spent months training in a specific way, the last thing you should do is change it, even if it seems like it'll be for the best. It's probably just nerves or excitement, but stick to your game plan. Unrehearsed changes are a recipe for disaster. So that's it. Thanks for watching, and if you've enjoyed it, please like, share, and subscribe.